M0FXP Hamtech, welcome to my channel. Zastone D9000 dual band transceiver also does air band, 27 megs, cross band, packed with features, removable head, changeable color of the screen, and so much more. But anyway, today we're looking at the three speakers. You have one in the main unit at the back here. It's a big solid unit, by the way. Nice head unit, and if you turn it round, you get this magnetic sort of holder with it, it's included or stand, uh, two magnet, magnetic items there, but then look, two speakers. So we have three speakers that we can play with. So I'm just gonna show you in this video how to look at them. So when you first turn on, you won't see a function menu. Press this function here. And it's a lovely sounding radio. Solid sounding, dual receive as well at the same time. So press the menu now. So you go function, then menu. And then go into set mode. You've got these other menus, but we're going to go into set mode. Press and go up and down. You can see I've been playing with it already. And you've got speaker select. So press enter. Now in the manual, I'll read what it says. You can, I'll turn to mode one. Mode one says the main unit's speaker is selected. Then we go to mode two. The controller's speaker is selected. So I would say that's the head unit. No, both may, both the main unit and the controller speaker are selected. Okay, and then it says push function to return to frequency indication or back. And that's it, so I'm going to leave it on both. So right now, the two head unit speakers and the main unit are selected. So I can see that if you, you know, connect a separation unit and you've got this unit on the dash, and this, the main, the sort of subunit in the boot, I suppose there's no point really having a speaker coming out of the, your boot, but then again, who knows? It might sound, might give you that stereo effect if you have both, I think it could be quite cool. Underneath the seat, yeah, it might sound quite good. But it's a fantastic set, very pleased with it, and it's so easy to change colors. Let's see if I can remember. Go to menu, then down to display, press it. And then you just toggle, you've got three choices here, green, red. Just toggle to the one you want to change, and then just start to change it, press it like so. And you can just, because it's sort of mixing LEDs together, you, all kinds of colors. On my camera videos, the orange one seems to look the best. But in real life, they all look fantastic, to be honest. It's just a really nice set. Microphone that's backlit as well. And Func every the, all the functional not all but many of the functions look at that that one's blue are um on here with a shortcut you just go function then you press the one you want and you, so you can change the squelch and bring in the tones and things like that and when it's receiving it goes you get the green lights and that's on the microphone as well and the same goes for ptt you get red so there's someone there uh, just transmitted on that my favorite place which is hubnet so yeah, highly recommend this set around £200. Bye for now, 7-3.